I'm gonna let me take a break, huh? Only authorized personnel are allowed beyond this point. You gotta be kidding me, it's fucking Helen! Oh, you're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But, sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job, nothing personal. You're, uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. my job. And I don't care about you. Time's up, motherfuckers. I am a super They pay me to tell them the intruders show up, so I do. Elevators on, enemies to do the honors. We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. Yeah, sure. It's not gonna kill them, right? Look, I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Are you fucking kidding me? Hmm, that wasn't supposed to happen. They died! What the fuck are you doing? Well, why, why'd you press the button, bounty hunter? Tweezy's gonna fuck you up! See, dipshit? I always get you into the cool secret rooms. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is our best human Fergal hybrid specimen. It may not be as cruel as our subject in the weapons lab, but it's still rather beautiful, isn't it? We call it a fur man, or, or maybe a hurdle. I don't, we haven't decided yet. Why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. Yeah, sick experiment, dude. You killed a human and left a Fergal on its corpse. Who's the scientist here, me or you, huh? Let's keep poking around. I'm actually getting into this. I want to see more freaky shit. Hello, John. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantuas I'd provide them. And now please don't contact me again. I'm busy. I don't trust this fucking gurgle and creep. seconds later when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan that's not so good of a feeling actually but I'm numb to it oh yeah that's one of my children they die fast don't worry it's easy to make more and it feels good god I love it feels good to thin out those g3 numbers you know it's fun
Was it helpful that I gave birth to a lot of tiny guys really fast? Hey, is this gonna hurt? Is this gonna hurt getting a weapon grafted to my arm? You're gonna graft a Gatlion to my arm, and that's gonna be permanent? Is that right? Because... I'm, I'm obviously down to do it. I'm just a little scared that it's gonna hurt a lot and that I'm also gonna regret not being able to use my hand in the normal way. Can you do my right arm? I'm left-handed, so if you do my right arm, I'll still be able to write. Oh, you know what I'm thinking, though? It's actually gonna be a problem because I, I'm left-handed, so I, I shoot with my left hand. So if you do my right arm, I might not be able to shoot as well. This is bad. This is probably... Okay, let me, just let me think. Let me think. I don't know. I don't know. Hey! Hey!
save your people. What are your people called again? Hubos? You're a very good looking Hubo. Maybe we should toss them some. No, wait, we can save them. Sorry, forgot about that option. Yeah, let's save them.
bringing me back out. I will never let you down again. I'm so sorry you don't like me very much. Okay, why didn't you tell me you had the sickest bedroom ever? I broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up to fetch a pail of water. Gary said... How fast do you think you're going right now? How many MPAs? I don't even want to guess. I feel like I'd get it really wrong and it'd be fucking embarrassing. Hey, we don't have anything good here. 200 miles per hour. Fuck, that was an insane guess. I'm sorry. says anything that offends you, uh, let me know. I don't care if I offend this piece of shit, Gublo. Jorb, how could you say such a thing? <laughs> nice going. You really know how to spot a good deal, partner. If we should get involved with anything illegal, it sounds too scary for me. I thought you were done with me. just broke my kidney. Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You wanted cum or what? 
You sell alien cum? Why the fuck do you do that, man? I know it's gross, but calm down. My name is Stan, and I sell horrendous amounts of all sorts of alien cum. And we're just gonna have to live with that knowledge together now. All right, uh, listen, we thought it over, and we'll take some alien cum. Whoa, look at you! You want some alien cum? I'm so glad you're interested. Look, you caught me on a good day. I'm doing a promo one time off for free alien cum. Take some on the house, and if you like it, just come back and get some more. Just tell all your friends about me. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Blim City selling alien cum to the community. Say all of that. Ah, looking for more alien cum, are you? Well, I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. But give me a little bit and I'll have plenty more. I promise. I just, I just need some recovery time.